Hey there, if you don't know me, my name is Maria and I like to talk about technology on the internet. And this week, instead of writing my history essay, which is supposed to be 4,000 words, uh, I kind of decided to, okay, do that, but also try to finally learn how to type on my mechanical keyboard that is split into two halves. So it's an ergonomic one, it's called the ErgoDocs Easy. So I actually got it like a few months ago, but I'm just trying to get used to the feeling of typing on a split keyboard and it's ortholinear. So I was trying to get used to doing that on the QWERTY layout, which is the normal layout that people have on their keyboards. But a few weeks ago, I decided to switch it to a more efficient layout, which is called Workman. And now I have tried to force myself this week to actually learn how to type with my new layout. And I've been using the exercises that are on the ErgoDocs website. And you'll see, I started at eight words per minute because I was so slow. And plus I'm typing with all of my fingers and it's a new, completely new layout where I don't know where all of the keys are. So it's very new and I kept messing up and trying to type the keys wherever the QWERTY ones were. So that was all a mess. So you'll see that. But today is the last day. I'm gonna see how many words per minute I'm at. And it's not gonna be high. <laughs> Don't expect it to be like 100 words per minute because I'm bad. Let's get started. So today is gonna be day one of learning how to type again. So well, hopefully it'll be not too bad. I don't know, I learned how to type maybe in high school kind of because I was jealous. We had this like grade nine business class where all my friends learned how to type properly and then I never did. So I just went on typing.com and learned how to type properly. And that was fun. And now I have to learn to do it again. And it's so annoying. And I just kept like procrastinating doing it. And now I'm just like, wow, I'm so slow. And I don't even know where my keys are because I'm not used to it. I'm gonna try to do the learning on the actual ErgoDocs website, which is what this keyboard is. And they have like some Alice in Wonderland stuff that you can write out. And I love Alice in Wonderland. So that, that's gonna be fun. Okay, so here I wanted to show you an example of what one of the exercises would look like on the website. So here's like a section from the Alice in Wonderland chapter six, and you do three of these exercises every single day basically, or you can do more of them obviously, but they just give you in sets of three. And this is in the pros section. So you can actually see my keyboard on the screen, which is really cool. And it's helpful because what my goal is, is to learn how to touch type. So that means I know where all of my keys are without having to look down at my keyboard, which is really good. I'm so bad at this. I can only get through like one out of four or five lines because I'm so slow. Oh, <laughs> so bad. And I keep looking down at my keyboard even though it's right on the screen. Okay, so when we actually finish the exercises, this is the page that we get to and it will tell us our accuracy for those exercises. So like the average breakdown from those three and then all of the errors that I made for which keys I pressed incorrectly. And then we actually have uh, the charts or the graphs which tell us how many words per minute we have and also our accuracy and as those will increase and decrease over time. And at the bottom of the page, you'll see your training history, which really reminds me of GitHub, which is funny with the little squares, the colored squares. Also, I'm pretty sad. I only got eight words per minute. Okay, I finally got past the first line on my third attempt. And yeah, I'm glad that I did that. And so I had so much problem with getting the E right, because the E is like in the center and I'm not used to that. And I keep hitting I randomly, even though I'm not supposed to, because my pinky just keeps hitting I. And yeah, I'm really bad at this. I so need to work on this. And I should have done this way earlier. So if you still don't know how to type properly with all your fingers on QWERTY, then you should do this with me. Try learning how to type with me. Today is technically day four of learning how to type on my new keyboard. Yeah, it's actually, I'm getting better. I started at eight words per minute, but now I'm getting much better. And I can feel that I'm getting more confident typing on my keyboard, even during like pair programming sessions with my teammates at work. So I think that's good because before I felt kind of scared to use my new keyboard because I would be too slow typing on it. Now I'm getting faster, then it's actually, I'm okay with using it. Who cares if they can hear my typing? <laughs> like maybe they'll like the sound. But yeah, so I'm gonna try doing the typing again today. And I've started doing some of the Alice in Wonderland stuff, like the pros section, as well as some of the coding section, because that's mostly what I use my keyboard for, basically. So we're gonna try doing that. Also, another thing I wanted to mention 
is that the way I lay out my keyboard is so that my shoulders are more open and I kind of try to have a good posture but as you can see here I'm not that good at it. <laughs> And also over here is one of the examples of coding and you can choose a few separate languages but I just chose Python for this one and it's just yeah practicing coding some example file basically and this one was harder because there's a lot more punctuation of course so that one is like I'm way slower at than the pros section. I'm trying to get faster with it but then I keep messing up so my accuracy is decreasing but my speed is increasing and that's not good and yeah I'm I'm trying to get better. Also, sometimes I still like mess up and look down at my keyboard, which I shouldn't be doing. I should just be like trying to memorize where things are. But I still find myself sometimes looking down at it, and that does slow me down, of course. So, trying to look at only the screen, and yeah, it's hard, but hopefully, over time, I'll get better at it. So, it'll be okay. Today is the last day, and let's see how many words per minute I can get. Yay, I'm excited. My goal is kind of 30, but I doubt that that's possible because I sometimes mess up and I still haven't reached like that flow type of state where you're typing because I still pause in between some letters because I kind of forget where things are a little bit if I am not using my keyboard before I start typing on these exercises. So it's still a little bit hard and I still haven't been able to get through the whole chunk of text within one minute. I usually get until like the second last line, not until the last line. But we'll see today how this goes. I'm actually getting into more of that flow. Like, okay, I know where the keys are on either side of it, on either side of the keyboard, because it's split, of course. So I know maybe which hand I need to use at a given point and if I know that one letter is on my say right hand and the other one is on my left hand I can like hit that one and already get my other hand ready to hit the other key that I already know so I think that's really cool and I think it's actually pretty interesting because I think that's a hard concept to grasp when you're first learning how to type with all your fingers on a regular keyboard that's all together on one base but I think it's actually cool when you have it split because then you have like you know that all of those keys are on that side and the other keys are on that side and you have which hand is for what because on the regular keyboard I, I see a lot of people just going like, doo -doo 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 -doo, all over the place with like one or two fingers but here it's like more forceful in the way that you have to learn how to type on it which is actually a pretty good thing okay I think I'm gonna stop here I finally got 26 words per minute I'm very happy with this result even though it's not like normal people like 50 words per minute 70 words per minute 120 words per minute that's fine with me honestly like i'm just starting to learn how to do it just getting used to it and i don't know typing fast doesn't really matter to me because it's not a gaming keyboard it's just like for work and i'll definitely continue practicing these exercises every day until i get better and you should follow me on instagram so i can give you some highlights in my story of my progress that was the video i hope you liked it i hope you learned that I suck at typing and that maybe you should try learning how to type properly on QWERTY using all your fingers or try and change your layout possibly because it might better suit the way that you like to type and which keys you use more. And if you like to watch more keyboard videos, then I have made one as well and I'll link it somewhere in the description or in this thing. And yeah, see you next time. Bye!